With over 35 years of expertise, Ardendorf Machinery Mart is a premier destination for top quality tools from reliable suppliers. Every MacAfric tool meets stringent standards, crafted for South African and broader African markets. Our sales team prioritizes excellent customer service and expert advice. We enhance our product range to provide high quality tools at affordable prices. Supported by proficient staff, in-house technicians, and a specialized repair center, we ensure efficient maintenance and repairs. Let's dive in. And in today's video we will be showing you how to balance a wheel using the MacAfric CB530 wheel balancer. This wheel balancer will handle wheel diameters from 10 to 24 inches, tire widths from 1.5 to 20 inches, and a total shaft weight of 60 kilograms. Now let's demonstrate how to use this machine. Switch on the machine. The screen will show a 00 reading, indicating it is ready to balance the wheel. Place the spring onto the shaft, followed by the wheel. Place the cone onto the shaft. Use a cone size appropriate for the wheel being used. Make sure it has a snug fit. Lock the wheel using the quick lock wing nut. Ensure the wheel is securely mounted on the balancer. Capture the measurements and profile of the wheel. Measure and input the following. Distance, represented by the letter A. Use the tool to measure the distance of the wheel from the machine. Enter the measurement on the machine using the up and down arrows, then press the side-by-side -side arrow button to add the next measurement. Width represented by the letter B. Use the width ruler to measure the wheel's width. Enter the measurement on the machine using the up and down arrows and then press the side-by-side -side arrow button to add the next measurement. Diameter represented by the letter D. Enter the wheel's diameter, shown on the wheel, on the machine. Close the hood. Let the wheel spin and allow the machine to provide the required weights to balance the wheel. Add the required weights, according to the screen. A 15 gram hammer on weight is needed on the inner side of the rim. A 30 gram hammer on weight is needed on the outer side of the rim. Slowly rotate the wheel until all the lights are lit up on the right hand side display. Then add the weight using pliers at the 12 o'clock dead center position. Repeat for the inner weight. Close the hood and let the wheel spin. The machine will verify if the weights are correctly placed and if the wheel is balanced. When the machine stops, check the machine reading. A zero reading on both screens indicates the wheel is balanced. Remove the wheel. Loosen the wing nut and then use the quick release trigger. You're completed and the wheel is now balanced and ready for use. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next one.